uh, you can sit on the floor or on the chair wherever you are sitting it's fine be very comfortable normal breathing we'll start with om chanting three times inhale oh oh normal breathing in rheumatoid arthritis our joints are affected so initially we will be doing giving exercises to our joints these are to make them flexible and to strengthen certain muscles around them these can be done 5 times 10 times 20 times or more depending upon the situation if you feel any pain anywhere or if you feel tired you have to stop immediately don't bear the pain too much so i'll be moving certain parts of my body which if if you are feeling hurtful then don't do it then avoid it and then we'll move to the next part these you can do sitting down or sitting on the chair also if you are unable to sit down for few minutes i will show you even on chair after doing it on the floor so initially we will start with our palms so first we will just move our finger joints if you are able to do it comfortably do it if there is certain pain in your palms then don't do it and these you can do any number of times but today we will be doing around 10 10 numbers then close your fist you have to rotate your wrist if you feel any pain on your wrist move it very slowly you can see once it on the chair and do it then move it opposite side relax your hand now move your palm up and down don't force yourself be easy in or on yourself relax then you can even fold it like this if you don't feel any pain on your wrist then other hand relax next we'll be moving our elbows even in case of elbows if you, if you have any pain anywhere try to avoid this if you are able to do half movement then do half movement if you are able to do full movement then do full movement so we will be doing 10 times if you don't have any pain you can do more times also keep your spine straight relax then if this is comfortable you can try this also one take like this and then this comes in two like this if it is comfortable on your arms
whenever you feel tired you have to relax or if you feel pain you have to relax that part relax relax for few breath be easy on yourself next we will be moving our shoulder joints again if you are able to rotate this much then rotate this much only if you are able to go more go for bigger rotation so depending upon your shoulder joint pain or the movement so you can even rotate like this also or further or go it further and then and then relax same way we will be moving our shoulder joint opposite side slowly if you are able to do this much movement then do this much movement if i able to do more do it more or further like this this you can do any number of times depending on your capacity so you have to strengthen your muscles around these areas and make your joints slightly flexible and slowly slowly it will you can go on doing it now we'll move to this one also this also you have to go very slow while doing this don't bring your head forward keep your head straight be easy on yourself always try to keep your spine straight relax and then opposite side relax normal breathing now we we'll straighten our legs try to keep your spine straight this i will show you on the chair you can do this sitting on the floor also or on the chair also but many many of them may not be able to sit on the floor so i'll show you this on the chair so first you have to move your toes of your feet now this also many people may not be able to move them but whatever possible you can try to move them 10 20 30 40 50 times this can be done on the floor or on the chair but i am showing you on the chair because many of you may not be able to sit on the floor so do this 10 times if you are not able to move your uh, toes then you can use your hands also to move them so just slowly you can do 10 times then next we'll be moving our ankle joint be relaxed try to keep your spine straight move them front and back we'll be doing it 10 times you can do it more time as said earlier if you have any pain try to move it lesser be easy on yourself breathing has to be normal then we will be rotating our ankle joints you can separate your feet slightly and then rotate your ankle joints slowly
these the joint moments which i am doing that you can do any time don't be to put special time for it any day any time in the day you can do this 5 minute 10 minute take out the time and then move these joints but the as later on the asanas which i will be showing you there you have to be those you can do around 3 4 hours after taking your lunch or lunch and one and a half hour after your snacks these you can do any time even if you are working you can do at your home or in the office front and back rotation then you have to move over knee joint now knee joint you can do it on the chair as well as sitting down also so one one knee two if you do it on the chair you will be able to move both both knees together then other one again if you are pain in your knees try to move them less you may not do it completely relax 